So, I wanted to talk about real world mileage in an unbiased, an unbiased video. Uh, this is uh, my 2021 Tesla Model 3. This is the long range dual motor. I have owned it now for three weeks. Uh, I am loving the car. Uh, today was my first experience um, on a little bit of a road trip. I wanted to, um, we went to the casino. I stopped, I uh, went from my house, my father's house, had my wife, and we drove um, to Oxford, Maine, played a little blackjack, uh, had some good luck, had some bad luck, but walked out a winner, that's all that really matters. So I wanted to see how close can we truly get to Tesla's 353 mile range. You know, all auto manufacturers always list the absolute best case scenario and basically an impossibly hard to get mileage. So I knew that getting to 350 would be just about impossible. So from Manchester, New Hampshire to Oxford, Maine and back, I started around at 95% charge and I got home uh, just about a half hour ago it is just about at 5%. Uh, there's, I think it's, the car says there's 25 miles of range left. Um, so we used about 90% of the battery and it was exactly 255 miles. So if we used the last 10%, I charge it up a little bit more, we probably could have hit about 280, but I think that would really be pushing it. So that's real world driving, That's that's not, doing 55 miles an hour with the AC off, tailgating an 18 wheeler. This is 80 to 85, uh, three passengers, AC's on, heated seats are on, uh, and just enjoying the car. Uh, again, it was 255 miles, we got about 20 miles left. Um, you know, you could talk about costs a little bit. Um, at 8.72 cents a kilowatt, which is what I'm paying, the entire journey round trip, it was $5.75 or just under. So um, that's pretty good. And again, I'll show about charging the vehicle. And as I uh, to pick up the camera here, we did have the PPF put on and the windows are now tinted. And I will be shooting a separate video on that. Uh, the car's actually pretty filthy. I don't know what this, how big this bug was that I hit. Um, but it's been raining every single day. I'm trying to go to the dragway, but again, it looks like it's going to rain. It's, it's never ending rain, but the, the Q car care where they did the, the PPF, they did an amazing job. I mean, you truly can't even tell there's PPF on these panels and that's, that's truly how it's supposed to be. So if we pop in the car real quick, just make sure the music doesn't come on, turn the Turn that off so it's quiet. We can see we got about 20 miles, uh, 20 miles of range left. Um, again, if we go uh, since last charge, we can see that it was 256 miles. We used 65 kilowatts, which comes out to 254 watts per mile. Now, I believe the battery is an 80 kilowatt battery or 82. So there's definitely more to it than, than we used. But again, I don't think you would have gotten another 100 miles or another 97 miles out of it. So this is it. We'll go ahead and uh, show you the charging again and, and how easy this is. Uh, compare this to going to the gas station and pushing in all your numbers. You just you take this, you go, just stick it in. So it's gonna be interesting to see how long it takes to charge from basically completely empty to, um, to full. And we're looking like about six hours, which um, I actually don't think is really, again, all that unreasonable. I mean, it's 12.30 now and um, you know, I, the battery will not often be this low, you know? So even with that, I'll still get all of my charging in on my time of use um, where I'm paying the cheaper electric rate. And you know, even if you work a lot like me, you're usually home for at least, at least hopefully six hours before you gotta go to work again. So, you know, that's about it guys. I am gonna shoot a uh, PPF and window tint specific video shortly. 
um, maybe hopefully as soon as Wednesday. And um, I am hoping to go to the dragway again uh, this coming Wednesday, but it's looking like rain. So um, that's what it, guys. I hope you enjoy. Uh, you know, for the Terminator guys, I I will be getting some more videos. You know, it it uh it is what it is. So um, thanks, guys. I hope you subscribe. Talk soon. Bye.